Franco, Rudy Galindo, Brian Boitano, and Paul Wiley. When Brian Boitano was eight years old, he put on his first pair of skates. Six months later, he learned five jumps in one day. Twenty-five years later, he skates in Landover for the eighth time in an event in an arena where he is king. Two years ago, Kurt Browning stepped into Brian's house. It was a devastating debut. He's known as the natural, his potential unfulfilled, until last year, right here in Brian's house. The warm-up is now over. Please clear the ice. other guys crazy. He just never makes a mistake. No one has this kind of technical strength. No one has this kind of mental strength. Kurt Browning, brilliant when he sets his mind to it. Embarrassing when he does it. I'm struck by the contrast between his performance last year and this year. He accepted Boy Connor's challenge this year, when last year he just was not up to it physically or mentally. And a total 49.9 matching Boy Connor's score in the technical program. That means Brian must now skate flawlessly to retain the title. One thing Brian isn't going to do is come out here and dance. Brian Boitano, and did he rise to the challenge? Why, that's the end of scores for Brian Boitano. 10, 9.9, 9.8, 9.9. Last year, Kurt Browning became the anointed one. Kurt Browning surprises anyone with the uh, championship.